Hey guys, it's me, Mini Gaming, and today I'm going to talk about how to use the obelisks in Ark Survival Evolved. So, I was going on YouTube and just scrolling along, and there's not really a how to use the obelisks um, update version uh, recently. Uh, the most like two years old, year old, and all that. So I was like, why not do a video to talk about how to use the obelisks in Ark, as they are a key feature in PvP and PvE. So at the moment I'm actually on a single player um, server with Steve who I forced him just to sh show you how to use these. So what I do is I walk up to the obelisk terminal and click Y or X and it will come up to this UI screen. Um, as you see it says Arc Data where I can put items in like this and it will bring up the items into the right hand side. Uh, creatures, it showed me what the 10 creatures are nearby, what I have Steve for the example and the ones what are already uploaded. And the other one is the tribute where you can use uh, artifacts to do a boss battle. But we're not going to talk about that, we're going to talk about how to transfer uh, animals and items to different servers. So what you do is you go to the creature section, uh, click on the uh, animal you want to, or dinosaur, what you want to transfer, and at the top right it says upload creature. So you click A, it will come up saying upload creature data. Are you sure you want to upload this creature data? This will lead destroying your creature and losing all its inventory. Don't be worried, um, it's not going to kill your creature. It means it's just going to upload it to the terminal and say if you've got like food in there it's going to drop it in a bag so i want to click a and as you see it says uploaded tamed creatures steve steve's there so you can now as i'm on a single player server you can go on a different map as a single player server and bring along steve but if you try and go on a pvp server for example you can't bring steve the only reason is that is because if you tame the dinosaur in a single player um, mode, it will go to single player servers. If you're doing PvE, it can only go to PvE servers. And for again, PvP, if you tame in the PvP server, you can only bring it along to PvP servers. And if you want to bring the dinosaur back, it, say if you got into a different server, um, what you do is just click on the um, animal, so bring Steve back. It says download creature and we want to download the creature and as you go Steve is now here and as you can see the bag is dropped and in the bag was some food okay um, so that's it really that's how you do animals um, and that's all you need to worry about um, that's all really um, you can actually do it in supply drops as well uh, say if the obelisks of, in PvP have been um, taken over by turrets you can do it in supply drops, but I think that's only for characters. But we'll do that in a different video. Um, I hope this video has actually helped you guys. Um, it definitely helped me when I started out. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if you want to see more of these like helping videos, tutorials, um, just leave a like. And um, I'll see you in the next video. See ya. Yeah.